can see them in the frames so you know they're working in between those two frames. Here you can see what the foundation looks like and then they draw the comb out. You can see how it's getting taller. They're filling up the cells with nectar that they've collected. And they use an enzyme in their body to mix it with the nectar to create the honey. They evaporate water out of it to a certain point with using their wings. And after the honey is evaporated, they then it becomes honey. And they cap it with the wax that they make from glands in their abdomens. The same wax that they use to build the comb. They're always busy. You can see the honey in there. I'm really quite lucky that the bees let me leave their frames out this long. You can see here in the corner, the wax cells aren't as tall, but they're working so fast at filling up the rest of the cells. Here are some bees collecting the honey that was in the comb here that I damaged when I took the box off the top of this box. They're so efficient, they don't, they don't waste anything. Like I said, they don't waste anything. Here's a drop of honey that I spilled, and they're picking it up and bringing it back into their hive. They live all winter long, and they form a big ball around the queen and keep her warm, and then they eat the honey as the winter goes by. And they heat the hive with their wings, their little wing muscles. It's always about 90 degrees, 93 degrees in the hive all winter. Mm -hmm.